Okay, here we go. Let's see what we can do on my warrior. I know over this weekend that some of you might have hit rock bottom. Okay, let's see. We're attacking. Um, I'm not going to go in until my teammates are ready. Okay, it looks like we got some teammates here. Let's go in and try to stop the cart. And maybe this weekend some of us hit rock bottom because of drugs. Maybe pornography, maybe alcohol. Um, maybe our boyfriends or girlfriends broke up with us. God forbid, maybe even we got fired on our job. Hey everybody, could I please ask you a favor? If you don't mind, scroll down below, click our subscribe button, because we could really use your help. Thank you very much. There we go. I mean, we're, we're stopping the cart. That's all that I can really do here. I could go chase kills like right there. But let me get back in the cart. I mean, if you're playing warrior uh, DPS, chasing kills, I think that's acceptable. But what would be even better than that would be stopping the cart. Okay, he blinked. I know over this weekend, um, my wife and myself had a terrible argument. I mean, it was pretty bad. And the Lord is using these arguments to change us. To refine us, to humble us, to show us he's the Lord and we are not. And the whole team is chasing me. All right, we'll get out of there for a few moments. We can suicide back in. I mean, they're moving the cart. Yeah, we'll back up, heal up, and go back in. No sense dying and starting over in the cave. Um. We need some of our... We need a tank and some DPS to get in there. If you hit rock bottom over this weekend, it's not because God is punishing you. If you are a chosen one of God, if you're a true chosen one, God is never punishing you. Never. Because you got the blood of Jesus covering you. You're completely forgiven. But like my wife and myself, maybe some of you on alcohol, drugs, pornography, losing your job. Would you believe me if I told you this is happening? Because God is blessing you. It's the exact opposite of what the church teaches. God is using all things for our good. Romans 8.28 Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're warrior DPS. We're going to 
play the cart, move it, and go after kills when we can. I, if somebody wants to suicide in, just kill them. Now you might be thinking, Garrett, that's impossible. You don't know what weekend I, I had. No, I do know. I've had about 3,000 of those. Or how about we'll just say 1,000 of those. I do know. I do understand. What you're, what you're into, I most likely was into also. I understand. And if you're a chosen one, I can share with you the Lord's using it for your good. Now when we're angry... Can we get that kill? Okay. So when we're angry, when we're dismayed at the Lord, when we're confused, when we're hurting, when we're having a temper tantrum, I, I know that it's hard to believe he's using it for our good. I go through that all the time. That's normal if you're going through that. But the goal is... I, I was going to chase that kill, but let's get back in the cart. Uh, the goal is is to keep believing he's going to use all things for your good. And as you keep practicing to believe that, with God's grace, you're going to get stronger in that belief. In Romans 8.28, you're going to get stronger. I mean... I could have chased a couple kills there, but to my dismay, they actually ran back in our cart and, and we killed them. See that group of four people right there? Like, I'm not going to chase them. Let them come into the cart and then we kill them. That's, hey man, that's warrior gameplay right there. I mean, it, it's so cool. So if you're a chosen one, and if you hit rock bottom this last week or this last weekend, the Lord's going to pick you back up. He's going to. Because you're one of his chosen ones. And he died on the cross for you. And he's going to pick you back up. It might be a couple days. It might be a couple weeks. It might even be a few months. And I've been through that. Hey everybody, could I please ask you a favor? If you don't mind, scroll down below, click our subscribe button, because we could really use your help. Thank you very much. But he's going to pick you back up. I've been through valley experiences that have lasted one year or longer. One year or longer. I've been through those. Not once, multiple times. I've been through some episodes that lasted nine months, five months, four months, three months. I used to count them. When I was in my terrible, terrible suffering, I would literally count the months. But then later on, I stopped doing that and realized the Lord knows what to do. He knows. Now you're thinking, Garrett, you don't understand. I lost my job. You're not hearing me. I lost my I lost my girlfriend. I've been an alcoholic for three years. I understand. If you're a chosen one, the Lord is using this for your good. It's causing you to pray. It's causing you to be more humble. Realizing you're not special. You're not important. There we go. Really, really good game. Praise God.
Look at that, 9-2, really good game.